it's late and I gotta go to bed. But it turns out uh, I was wrong about a couple of things in my recent review of 7-Up Shirley Temple. One, Shirley Temple Black did not actually serve in Congress. She ran for Congress once and lost. She did serve as an ambassador on a couple of different occasions. Um, and the other thing was that 7-Up hadn't tried any new flavors since the 80s. I had forgotten about one that was released earlier this year and uh, because it was so fairly uh, obscure. 7-Up Tropical. Again, just released this last year to almost no fanfare. And it's nearly impossible to find. It's, I guess, just under a really limited uh, production run because it's... Um, I was at, at a grocery store, happened to be there when the guy brought out the pallet of uh, 12 packs to refill the the store shelves. And amongst the myriad uh, different kinds of soda pop you had available, there was one 12 pack of 7 Up Tropical, which I scooped up. And uh, that's why this is in a can. So, interesting uh, premise here for the tropical uh, flavor. It says it's a tropical flavored soda. What does that mean? Uh, unfortunately, the label doesn't shed any light because it it uh, it subsumes all the all the flavors it's put in under natural flavors. Okay, great. <coughs> Excuse me. Still caffeine free. We're getting a little little idea of what tropical might mean with a slice of. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Slice of fruit and a, another fruit, probably a, a peach or a mango or something. Tropical to me usually sounds like pineapple or something else. So I got a <coughs> frog in my throat. Let's get to this, shall we? That's better. All right. First impression is, yeah, I guess they consider the peach, they consider peach a tropical fruit because that's definitely something that you can taste. I suppose that other flavor might be mango because there's a there's a bit of mouthfeel, a bit of... Mm, Way it sticks to my teeth is reminiscent of the uh, Mountain Dew uh, Baja uh, flavor, the, the Laguna Le Laguna Lemonade. That was it, which is supposed to be a mango lemonade flavor. That was definitely a mm, mm, bit of fuzziness. But then again, that could also be down to the peach. Again, I'm not sure why they consider a peach tropical. A mango, sure, uh, but I would think tropical fruits are more like bananas, pineapple, um, um, guava. Passion fruit, something like that. Mm. Actually, come to think of it, I don't know if passion fruit is a tropical fruit either, so never mind. But anyway, wow. This is a, a yummy, fruity 7-Up. Uh, it's not quite as crispy as regular 7-Up. It doesn't have that, that crispy edge. Um, it's the, well... Let me, let me uh, see some uh, check something here. Well, it feels about on a par with regular Seven Up. It's not as heavy as a Mountain Dew, not as rounded as um, uh, not as rounded as a, a what was I going to say? Like a Code Red. It's not not that smooth. Hmm. But wow, that's that's a surprisingly robust fruity flavor coming from Seven Up. Gone is any hint of lemon lime. So let's see what the color is, shall we? Since I was only able to get cans, you'd expect the tropical Seven Up to be sort of a yellow or maybe an orange. And look at that. That's interesting. It's uh, it's the orange to Cherry Seven Up's red, I suppose. Very pale. 
Uh, no, I'm not the best with colors, but I'm going to guess that's an orange, maybe a green. Mm. All right, I apologize. This isn't one of my strongest uh, videos here. But that's the price we pay for doing it um, in one take, fresh out of the gate with no um, rehearsal, as it were. I hadn't seen this before. Didn't know what color it was. I didn't have not, not seen it in a two-liter bottle. So this is like, oh, that that's interesting. The, uh, well, let me put it this way. In, in consistent, or to be consistent with 7-Up, it just got a subdued color. Very much more transparent than, uh, say, a, a, a Mountain Dew or a Coke. Not that Mountain Dew isn't transparent. Anyway. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, it's definitely reminiscent of, of the Mountain Dew Sweet Lightning from KFC, which is a, a peach and honey. You can definitely uh, tell the peach here. And again, that other lingering, that's either the peach itself. What is it with peach? Earlier this year, there was a peach Pepsi, and around the same time, of course, because this was released uh, uh, fairly early in the year, like February or March, if memory serves, um, the, the, this peach 7-Up, and there's this sweet lightning at, at uh, KFC. Of course, it's been there for, that's been there for a couple of years. Mm. Um, so, mm. well... I tell you what, that's that's a pretty tasty soda. It's a refreshing change of pace from a regular lemon lime. Um, it's got a lot of uh, it, it's got certainly got a, a flavor that stands up on its own. So uh, it uh, I don't know that it, I would really uh, it, it's great for if you just want something to drink. It's got no caffeine, so uh, it really isn't like a pick 'em up if you're on the road somewhere. But if you're just thirsty uh it'd be a fine choice um not so much with a with a sandwich or anything but uh on its own it'd be great uh the the, the of course the thing is good luck finding it uh not that i exactly live in a major metropolitan area but uh i imagine instances of this in the stores are going to be few and far between you're gonna have to have a pretty big store with a pretty big selection and a pretty big uh area excuse me to find this or just be lucky like i was the, the, the one time um but if you you can find it and you're looking for a bit of a zip uh especially uh now that we're uh getting into the holidays and into winter uh, this is the, the thing for you so uh, uh yeah would i take this over a regular seven up uh that would depend. I guess if I, uh, it's got the same kind of fizz and mouthfeel, so I guess it would be the same thing for an, for an upset tummy. Uh, it's just that if you would like uh, a little more fruit flavor, instead of just a regular lemon lime, this would be the, I, I would take this. if I would, if, um, So most of the time, I would take this over a regular 7-Up. I guess if I just needed something with a sandwich, I would take the regular 7-Up instead of this, but just about every other time, I would. I would take this. Pretty tasty. So if you can find it, good luck, enjoy. Thank you for watching and have a good night.